just released. Don't be nothing wrong. Ain't nobody did that to you. But you just start flooding. Say that. Wow. And, and, and when God is in the midst, he know why you flood. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I yes, was sir. Uh, in a conversation today. And, and I say, this fellow gets happy. Yeah. He gets overjoyed yeah. because of the joy of the Lord that's in his heart. Yeah. When God bless somebody else, he gets happy. Yes, yeah. Yeah. Uh, when, when God is, 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 is taking care of somebody else, he gets happy. Yeah. And sometimes you look and say, what's wrong with you, man? He's just bubbling over yeah. because he has... The love in his heart for his brothers and sisters. Come on, yeah. come on. Now, now this is what it's going to take. You know, we have we had a marvelous night week. Yeah. Marvelous week. Yes, sir. Yeah. But if it don't go no further than tonight, yes, sir. Mm. It ain't worth a peel of beans. Amen. It has got to be implanted in you and change your life. Amen. Amen. The way you live, the way you think, the way yes. you do what you do. Yes. The word of God yes. is the only way to live in you. Amen? Amen. 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 Let us think about a word from the book of 1 John in his first chapter. Uh -huh. And it's 14 verse. Yes. Amen. When, when we believe in God and his deity, when we believe all he did through Jesus Christ, for us, a wretch and undone. Amen? Amen. Amen. You can see why they want to give him praise, why they want to exalt him, yes. because he's done so much. Amen. So much. So much. So much. From the first chapter of the book of Gospel of John, uh -huh. first chapter, uh -huh. 14 verse. Yes, sir. Amen? Amen. 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 We ready? Yes, sir. Hold on. That's what you're supposed to say, bro. Hold on. First John. 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 First John. John. First John. The Gospel of John. The Gospel. All right. John, first chapter, 14 verse. Amen? Amen. And in there we have these words. And the Word was made flesh. Huh? And the Word was made flesh. Get on out of here. And dwell among us. And we beheld his glory. The glory as of the only begotten. Huh? The only begotten of the Father. Full. Full. Press down, shaking together. Full of grace and truth. And truth. Hallelujah. Amen? Amen. Amen. One more time. And the word was made flesh. Pete yourself and tell you flesh. All right. And dwell among us. And we beheld his glory. The glory as of the only begotten of the Father. Full of grace and truth. Yes. Amen? Amen? The words been here. Right. It just didn't get here this week. Amen. The word of God has been here. Amen. The word of God in the book of Genesis spoke. And the fragments and the sun and the moon and the stars move. Come on. The word of God has been here. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. The only question I have, the only fear that I have, that the word of God is not in my kindred, my brothers and my sisters, because when the word of God is in you, it is what rules your life. It is what calls Amen. your shots. Yes. It's been here all this time. Yes, Lord. Yes. I, I can remember I was thinking today when, 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 when God began to change my life. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got baptized 
at 16, but it, my mama know it had nothing changed. Uh huh? Uh -huh. One, one, one evening around 6.30 in the evening, I, I had me a, a brand new car, pretty and shiny, was looking good. And there was this old bald head man that drove up to my daddy's house in a 61 Ford standard shield, amen? Amen. All right. And that thing would not, the battery was dead. He couldn't crank it up. And any of y'all that's got any age, you know how you, you can't do it with them automatic now. But when they had the standard shield, you could push them off yep. and start them up. Yes, sir. Yep. And, and, and this old man was sitting in the road, and I put that brand new car on his bumper. And he about to freak out. I didn't know what he was freaking out about. Pushed it down the road and cranked his car up, and one day he said, You push me with that new car? <laughs> See, it's something about things that get us messed up. Amen. Uh -huh. Come on, man. Our brothers and our sisters' well being is far more than our possessions, Amen. our earthly possessions. Amen. I didn't realize it then, but the old man realized, and from that day forward, he continued to press uh -huh. in my life. Amen. He, he said, he said when I started going to the Bible classes and, and stuff, he said, that boy right there argued with a stop sign. <laughs> you know why, don't you? Don't accept nothing that you don't know to be the fact. Amen. Come on then. Amen. You need to know it in your heart that you're going the right way. Don't go just call John and Mary going. Come on, Come on right. preach. Right. Know that it is, in fact, the word of God. It's been here all the time, but we just get introduced to it. Yeah. Some of us may be 20 or 40, 50, 60 years old, just getting the introduction yeah. into the word of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. John began to preach. And his main theme was, it was even there in the beginning. What you say? <laughs> this word that he that he so profoundly framed out as to be the word. Positioned it high in the heavens to be the Son of God, King of kings, Lords of Lords. This is the word that he's talking about, amen. amen. He's talking about that Jesus that you think. Came through the Virgin Mary, huh? He Amen. just made his entrance into life for to redeem man from his sins through the Virgin Mary. But he was there all, all the time. time. All the time. All the time. Woo. He know your in and your out. Yes, he knows everything about Amen. you and I. Yes, sir. Right. Yes, sir. Some of the stuff we have forgot. Evil, evil. He knows all about it. Come on, come on, man. Come God on. is. Hallelujah. And he always will be. And we have got to fashion ourselves to him. Amen. 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 We do too much self-kingdom building. Uh -huh. Huh? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And if we ain't building our self-kingdom, we're building some man's kingdom Amen. or some woman's kingdom. And then we, we, we just leave God off. Yes. You wonder why people are committing suicide, jumping off bridges, because they have made things on earth their God. Amen. Yes, sir. Amen. And when it drift off and thrown away, see, ain't nothing wrong with loving your wife with all your heart. Love her. But realize that there's a God that sits high. Come on. Yes. Come on. Ain't nothing wrong with uh, being the best and beautifulest woman for your husband. Yes. But realize there's a God. Come on. Yes. I have seen it in my life. Men and women fall short of the glory of God. Amen. My brother Dan Doe, but he had so much faith in his pastor that he stopped coming to church. Amen. Mm -hmm. He just wouldn't come because he had esteemed him high above. And when he opened the door and looked into the man, he said, I don't want nothing else to do with it. Mm -hmm. He come to my house and will take my pocket knife out and cut him. Yes, Lord. 
Yes. Sir. But it's because you esteem other things above God. Come on now. Do you not know that Come on. when life begins to fail you, yes, sir. when people begin to fail you, mm -hmm. you can look up and say, Lord, have mercy. Yes. Yes. He going to yes. come see about you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. He going to be your doctor. Yes. Huh? Yes. In your sick room, there ain't nobody there. Nobody. He going to be right there working on you. He's been there all, all the time. time. Yeah. Preach. Yes, and all you need to do, preach, is trust in him. Yes. Keep your faith in him. Yes. Do what he said do. Love your wife the way he said love her. Yes. yes. Do love your husband. He didn't tell you to love your husband. But to be towards your husband the way God he said, said be. Uh -huh. Yes. Good treat word. your friends the way God said treat them. Yes. Good word. Good word. Yes. And when you do that, you'll find yourself not being held accountable for your husband, for your wife, for your friend, Come on. because you have boundfully carried out the will of God, God in your life. Yes. Amen. 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 Good word. Yes, sir. I'm telling you, I'm a living witness. Yes. Yes. Here we are. When you carry out the will of God, people look at you strange. Yes. That man just lost everything he had. You know how the boys came to Job? Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Huh? The boys come to Job, they know they was good buddy. They know, say, man, you got to be the deal something. You don't deal something. God moved his hand against you. <laughs> you got to be guilty of something. Job stood his ground. He said, look, I, 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 I'm just as good a teacher and just as good a judge as you are. Yeah. And I ain't going to let you tell me what I've done and I know I had not done. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Huh? Come on. I ain't going to do what it takes to get along with you. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. When I realize who God is in my life, he is a supreme being in my life. Supreme. Yeah. Supreme. There's nothing like him on earth. Nothing. Uh, Nothing. 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 When, 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 he, when he gave account of it, he said, My thoughts are not your thoughts. And my ways are not your ways. For as far as the heaven is above the earth, then my ways then your ways. And my thoughts are your thoughts. So you, you can't balance yourself out with God. You just need to humble yourself in Him. You just need to call for your. Horses uh -huh. yeah, and submit yourself to God. Uh -huh. yeah, come on, man. Yeah, yeah, you who you are. Yes. You're a precious vessel in Christ. The Bible calls us a royal priesthood, yes, a holy nation. Yes, but He didn't give you arrogance and cockiness. He didn't give you that. Amen. Ooh. Pastor said last night, Jesus said, a bruised reed. Yes. He wasn't going to break. Yes. A smoking flat. He wasn't going to put, go to put the little light out that's in, inside no. that dog's stem. No. He wasn't going to do it. He came to give life. And he came that you can have life and that you can have it more abundantly. Come on. Come on. See, when you, when you have God in your heart, uh -huh. it don't hurt so bad when folks say stuff to you right. that's out of turn. Yes, sir. Right. Yes, sir. It don't hurt so bad. But when you missing the basic elements of love and faith, in, in your in your heart, when you don't have yes, hope in your heart. Yes. When you don't have the joy of the Lord yes. in your heart, yes. and somebody move anyways against you, they flip your little world upside, upside down. down. That's it. Without God in your life, mm -hmm. Amen. Come on, man. When I was when I was a young man getting into the Word of God, they sung a song. Without God, I can do nothing. Without Him, I would fail. Without Him, my life would be ruined. Like a ship without a sail. Without God, I can do nothing. Nothing. And all I need to do is focus on Him. Yes. Concentrate on Him. Yes. Meditate on Him. Yes. Through His Word. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes. Through His Word. Just yes. apply yourself into His Word like you do into a big plate of fried chicken, a baked yes. chicken, Woo, a barbecue on. chicken. Come Just apply yourself yes, into His Word. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let his word be tape or tailor salad to you. Yes, sir. Some of y'all gonna say tailor salad, but for tailor salad to you. Amen. Amen. Let his word be like a good old pan of baked beans. Preach. You can't get by that. Yes. All right. Yes. It is nourished. Y'all know.
no good yeah, anyway. Y'all go to sleep when you get to eating that stuff. Yeah, when you, you, when you, when you labor in the word of God, you ought to feel like you need yeah. some rest. Yeah. yeah. When you're truly laboring in the word of God. Yes, sir. <laughs> it's been right here all the time. All the time. Can, can you can, can, can you use your can you use your imagination to think about some of the obstacles and fragments and things that's been thrown up in the air to distract you yeah. from focusing on the word of God? Yeah. Yes, sir. Some of y'all can't even remember what some of those things are. <laughs> but they kept you, kept you from going to Bible class. Kept you from studying the word of God. They kept you. Some of it was your husband. Some of it was your wife. Some of it was your children. Yeah, but it kept you from. Yeah. And the adversary knows where your heart is. And where your heart is is where he's going to attack you. Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. He's coming after you. He said, look, Amen. I've been going to and fro in the earth. If you ain't got your stuff right. It's like being audited by the IRS. Amen. You Amen. ain't got your stuff right. You finna have to pay some money. Amen. They gonna seize your bank account. Yes. Yeah. Satan will seize your whole entire life where you can't get along with Ooh. nothing or nobody. Yeah. He'll take over. Yeah. And once he know what it takes to get you, yeah. he starts shoving at you like a deck of cards. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. You find yourself not focusing on God being here all the time. There's nothing new about his presence. What it has been. We as adults must cease in failing our children. Come on, I ain't gonna let you stop me, Carl. The word of God says such. When I get ready to spank my child, uh -huh. I spank them and slap them and knock them down to the ground with the word of God for a belly or touch their bottom. Uh -huh. Amen. Yes, Come yes. on. Word of God is what's going to change them. Yes, yes. The word of God is what's going to yes. make them better. Yes. yes. Preach. All that belt for them to get their attention. Yes. Amen. Take them away from that carnal mind. Our children are so flexible. Yes, they are. They're so flexible. They are. They can get on the wrong road and yeah! Say that. And be gone. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. They won't know they're wrong because you had took the time out to tell them. You had took the time out to teach them. And God is here all the time. They wait, they go to church, they sit in church, they draw, they paint, they do whatever they do. And they ain't paying no attention to the word. And you got some old folk do the same stuff. Uh -huh. Amen. Tell the truth. But when, 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 when you, when you yes, sir. cause yourself to focus in the word of God, in the I tell folks, I say, look, when, I, when I'm talking to some men, I say, let me tell y'all. Yes. The Satan has had me to the point where I wanted to kill folks. Yes. Uh -huh. Laid it out for me how to do it. Tell the truth. Yes, sir. Amen. And if you don't say get behind me, Satan, He'll make you Your name will be in the paper, money Yes, sir. He'll make right. you do it. <laughs> and you don't have to be no lay member. You can be a preacher, too. Amen. You can be Amen. preaching the word of God and say to tip up in your back door. Come on, come on now. And show out. Mm -hmm. Say so. Yes, sir. Then you get up, get up, get up and walk your way down to the jail and say, run, but you can't hide. You can't hide. You know better. You, can't you knew better than to be caught up. Into the things of the world. Yeah. If you know a cookie will cause you to want some candy? No. <laughs> Come on. Huh? Uh huh. Yeah. It just, just figure, you know, when they, when they taught us about drugs, they, 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 had, to, the, they had to low case drugs. Amen? Uh -huh. But they say, reason why they were fighting the low case drugs, because once you get all you can get of that, then you got to upgrade. Yeah, you know what? You started out riding in a little bitty car. Now you want a big car. Yeah. Now everybody want an SUV. Yeah. <laughs> you had to upgrade. Yeah. Come on. So if you don't fool with those things, period, uh -huh. then, then you know what? If you, if you, you live your life. You do as much as you can for the Lord. Amen? Amen. 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 
And they keep your hands out of a lot of other stuff. Yeah, that's right. yes. And then you sitting there old and the folks go to talk about uh, how much liquor they can drink, how many women they slept with, what they done did this, they done did that, they done did this. Uh -huh. And everybody's like, oh, so old, yeah. yeah. And then look at you like you crazy about saying, no, I ain't did I all that. I, I, got my, I got my exes against me. Yeah, but I ain't did all that. But some of that stuff you got around. Why is your fall in every pitfall? Amen. Amen. And don't let nobody educate you to the fact that you uh, are sinning. Come on. Uh huh. Huh? Uh -huh. Yes, sir. You, you, you spank your baby, yeah? Yeah. Yes, and again, your baby can't never be right, can't never do what's right, what you spanking him for. <laughs> we have been bushwhacked with the world's junk. Train up a child in the way you should go. Come on. And we know, yeah. I'm going to tell you, I pulled my gun out of my glove compartment because the man owed me $15. And I asked him about my $15. He was drunk. And he was, oh, oh, oh. you going to talk to me like that about my $15. Uh -huh. I went back to my truck, reached in the glove compartment, got that long nose third eight out of there, checked the revolver, and the Holy Spirit said, you gonna you gonna kill a man by fifteen dollars? I put that gun up. I ain't never asked that man for about that fifteen dollars from that day to this. Come on in. All right. But if you ain't got it in there, yeah. What is gonna what is gonna guide you? You walk you walk around mad all day, kicking stuff and slamming doors. Yeah. And want nothing to say nothing to you because it's in there. Preach. Something I'll tell you. Preach. Preach. Yes. That ain't the way to act. Yes. Look, I, 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 I tell the fellow sometimes, my wife, she wasn't my wife then, we were real good friends, she dropped me off at the airport. Uh -huh. And I said, well, I'm going to stop in here and get me some stuff at Sam and for the tape with me on my trip. Uh -huh. We ended up in the store. Man, I bet that gorilla will be in that bro right there. <laughs> Big old gorilla. And she said, I want that gorilla. And I say, you must be crazy. You know me. Everybody know me, you know how I respond quick. I'm out there, throw them out there right quick. I turn and I, I turn and look back. And she was laying with her head side to go real. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and I just melted like I spent $4 for a big old stuff go real. <laughs> she just come out of that store with her mouth poked out. Drop me off at the airport and boom, be low. Yeah. <laughs> but it is what you do, what's in your heart, is what's going to make you yes, sir. excel. Yes, sir. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. And then stop trying to be mean to folks. The Bible says don't run an evil for evil. All right. That's but contrary a wise, a blessing. Yes, that's the word. And when we do that, yes, sir. we'll exercise the knowledge that we have that God is here. All the time. All the time. All the time. All the time. Don't think ain't nobody in the house. You, I know you go in your house, close your door, and let up you and your wife. You can't say what you want to say. You can't do like you want to do. God is watching you. All the time. And it said that he's keeping a record of every. Come on, come on. Come on, I was going to say that with D, but you went all the way into my mind and my heart. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he keep a record of every item thought. That don't nobody even know you thinking it. Yeah. Come on. Be over. God is pressing us to do the right things. Yes. And when we do the right things, we'll realize that everything that we have was, not was, but do belong to God. Amen. All things were made by him, yeah. and without him was anything. Without him. Without him? Yes, sir. How, how you going to function? Preach. Yeah. How you going? Oh, yes. oh, I can't move my hands. I can't move my feet. I, I can't tell. Yes. Without him? Yes, Lord. And God knows I can't see without him. Come on, amen. Good word. He's been around us. Yes. Some of us has collected him and we didn't read. We collected him from our ancestors. Our grandmothers, our grandfathers, and our great. We just watched their demeanor, amen? Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, when I didn't know nothing about studying the Word of God, I used to. They, they all did now, I'm telling you. I used to slip up under the house. 
And let, let them women talk about their life and what was going on in their life. And when they got through talking, I would hear, my mama was messed up, y'all. I don't know what she had, the Holy Spirit or something. Cause she would always tell them, say, baby, do what you're supposed to do. Yeah. And I would look where I see them women hanging them clothes out on the line, the men be down the road at their other family's house. Yeah. Uh -huh. And them women would have their dinner ready. And guess what? When the food got done on the stove, they fit his plate, wrapped it up, put it in the oven for whenever he made it to the house. Whenever. But you know, I'm a living witness. That those men died 30, 40, 50 years ahead of those women. Because God promised to bless you if you do what he said. Not because of your position. Not because of your position, who you are. Come on. He going to bless you according to your obedience. To him. To him. And stop seeing people too big. Tell it, bust your head. You can't, they, they, they ain't doing what you think they ought to be doing. They ain't going where you think they ought to be going. Okay. And now you can't even focus no more. Yeah. Forgot all about God. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Uh, when I was a young man growing up and trying to go out in the world, slipping out from the house, uh -huh. huh? Uh -huh. I come back to the house every one evening. By dust dog, you know, we had a rule. Mm. Dust dog, dust you and y'all. Uh -huh. But I didn't have to make it back and live after dust dog. Uh -oh. And I could hear my mama praying. Yeah. Like she did that morning at 3 or 4 o'clock when her mama was dying in Detroit. I could hear the, the, the tenderness in her voice, yeah. the way she was praying, her concern about her mama. Yes, Lord. And that woman was praying with that same tender and called my name. I could have went up under the house. Uh. Had no evil on my mind, but she knew that evil was present. Yes. Yes. If you ain't at home, then you. Then like my boy said, they stopped me and gave me a ticket down at three in the morning. I said, yes, yeah, son, they ain't give me no ticket. Because I was at home. I was at home in the bed at three in the morning. Come on, come on, man. See, see, we, we yeah. come accustomed to doing stuff, yeah. and our kids are watching us. Yeah. Yeah. They watching us. Yes. Amen. So you, you, you know, the first thing my boy said when school out, he think he can stay up all night. Then oh, okay. he get mad. He, he don't say nothing, but he get mad. when you tell him to go to bed. Let TV all go to bed. Let that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Say that. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yes. And then when you when you see, I'm gonna tell you, here's a blessing for you. Okay. When you see your children that walk beside you every day, start to emulate the ways of God. Come on, come on, come on. Mm -hmm. Huh? And they, they, they turn around and tell you what the truth is. Yes, Lord. Oh, you, you you can say glory, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because everybody needs to know before they get in trouble who God is. Amen. 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 He needs to know. And he's right there for you. Yes. If you just believe in him, trust in him above all this other stuff that's going on in our lives. Amen? Amen. Amen. This man that was sent from God talked the message the way God told him to, to, to do it. Yes. Yes. Preach the word. Amen. Be instant. In season, out of season. Rebuke. Hey, brother, you don't, need to, you don't need to be going over there, brother. Uh -huh. If he cuts you out, that's on him. That's on him. Yes. Amen. Hey, so, hey, 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 sis. Well, I love the way you handle that situation. Yeah, exalt. Huh? Uh -huh. Exalt. Yes. With all long suffering, because you're dealing with flesh and blood. Uh, amen. With all long suffering, yeah. and watch out. Yeah. Make sure what you're telling them is in the word of God yeah. and not some junk you done learned yeah. somewhere else. Yeah. Amen. 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 The word of God is what you build your brothers and sisters up with. Preach. Preach. You can, you can help them and, and show them some stuff. It don't, it don't make no sense for generation after generation to fall into the same trap. The same trap. Granddaddy failed him. Great granddaddy failed him. And I found my dad in him too. All at the same time. Yeah. 
the awesome power of God was right there before you. Okay. You think you made it out of that stuff by yourself? No. No. God was watching over you, taking care of you. Thank Get you to where you are now. You. Where you can lift your hands and say, Lord, I thank, thank you. you. Lord, I praise you. I praise you. Yeah, yeah, I, I realize it now. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lord. Yes, sir. When you can back, when you can drive down the road and remember mm. when you were doing some low down dirty thing over there. And I'm tell you, I've asked myself, was that me? Uh -huh. yeah. All right. Well, what? you can't believe that you were so gold found in this numb stuck on head. <laughs> The devil had you wrapped up, tied up, and tangled up, and you didn't even know it. Yes, sir. Say that. You were too busy doing what you were doing. Yes. But oh, that God of mine. Oh, God. Yeah, come on, oh, come God. on. He was there oh, all the time. Oh, he was oh, right there. Come on. Right there. He's right oh, there. He's gonna be. He's gonna be right there tomorrow. Yes. Yeah. He's gonna be right there. Yes, sir. And all you gotta do is acknowledge him. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. When you do what? Direct, Direct your path. Yes. Yes. In all your ways. Yes. My mama told me that long before I read it in the Bible. Yes. Baby, whatever you're doing, seek the Lord before you go do it. Yes. Yes. Seek the Lord. Yes. Even if you think you're going to do something wrong, seek the Lord. Yes. Before you. Mm. Yeah. And then sometimes you'll change your mind, you change your heart. Amen. Amen. Yes, that's it. God is an awesome God. Yes. And you know that joy that you feel in your heart. I, I, uh, uh -huh. As I get ready, I'm gonna go to my seat. Yes. But as you get, as you as you start bearing witness out in the world, you start seeing people, happy people, mm -hmm. people accomplishing things that they dreamed about accomplishing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you just sitting there so happy with him, tears just running out of your eyes. Oh, yeah. Amen. Huh? Amen. You just so happy that you just glad there ain't nobody in the room but you. Yeah. Or they gonna yeah. say you crazy. Yeah. Yeah. You know what they call you now when you cry out of turn? Uh -huh. They call you bipolar. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. They say uh -huh. you bipolar. Yeah. That's right. Because you have feeling in your heart. Yeah. Because you have <laughs> compassion in your heart. Yeah. Because you have love in your heart yes, for your fellow man, they're gonna say you bipolar. Yes, and yes, you need yes. to take this pill. Yeah. 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 You need to calm down. That's what mm -hmm. you're saying. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. When the school teacher, when the school teacher can tell you that a child will stand up in class and say, uh, I'm just acting out because I ain't had my medicine. Say that. Uh -huh. See that? See? See? We're in trouble. Mm -hmm. Amen. So now we have got to. Realize God is right there. Yes. If you went to pay for your gas and forgot you had your debit card or your cash in your pocket, yes. you'd be lost. Because mm -hmm. you couldn't get it. You used to go pump the gas then pay for it. You can't do it no, no more. No, 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 no. So before you get ready to make any move in life, any motion in life, realize that God is right there. Reach out and touch him. Yeah. <laughs> Come on then. Reach out and touch him like you do that chip. In that debit card. Yeah. <laughs> Let him be the pen that you punch in. Yeah. That pen devil. Yes, sir. Yeah, when, 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 when you want to move yourself up a little bit further. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. Because you about to run out of gas, punch in your pen. Yeah. Right, That's awesome. Punch it in. That's awesome. And when you do that, when you realize that God is right here all the time, you're going you're gonna, to you're gonna be less steamed up at folks. Yeah, come on, huh? come on. It's going to be hard for folks to make you mad. Yeah. Yeah. They're going to say, what's wrong with it? Yeah. I'm going to tell you as I go to my seat. I had the awesome task. And I tell you, I've seen people lose wives in all kinds of forms and fashion. But I'd rather lose one for divorce than for death any time. Amen. Huh? Amen. Look, Amen. I, caught I had went through it. And the people, people that saw it, they said, you know what they say about you? They say the same thing about me and my wife now. Oh, they just the sweetest couple. Oh, they're so sweet. They don't know what's going on in the house. They just see you walk in the, in the building together. Uh, yes, sir. Huh? 
-hmm. They don't hear you yeah. talk to one another. Yes. They don't hear none of that stuff, amen? Yeah. Yeah. But they, they, they mold you and shape you and put you on a pedestal that, that you get. The lady come in and she hadn't seen the lady come to church. I ain't never stopped going to church. I ain't know nobody going to stop me from going to church. Say that. My Bible teacher told me one day, he said, boy, don't let that Bible stop you from going to church. Amen. And I said, well, that dude was crazy. Yeah, what but he had a lot of sin. Right. Because when I started going to church repetitiously, I saw most stuff going on in there. What about Jesus? Mm -hmm. I said, oh, well, I see what, That's what he was I see what he meant. Yes, sir. It'll stop you. Yes. Low down, folk. Mean folk sitting right in the altar. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And they'll make you turn around and go back if you're looking at them. Keep your eyes and your what? mind focused on the Lord. Say it. You, Say it. I tell them all the time, the first service, worship service that was attended, two brothers made it. Mm -hmm. God told them what to do in the worship yeah. service. Uh -huh. huh? One did like some of us, whatever he wanted to do. And the other one did exactly what God told him to do. Yeah. And then, see, God ain't, God ain't narrow sighted like man. Yes, 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 sir. Huh? You yes, couldn't sir. fool God. Yes, sir. Huh? Just because you put a hundred dollars in the plate That's didn't mean you put what you should have put in. <laughs> Amen. Come on, man. But you can't fool God. Come so, on. so, so when you see when you when you see these people doing these things, yes, sir. You need to focus on God. Amen. Amen. Focus on Him. Yeah, good word. And if you focus on Him, yes. It's going to take a whole lot of stress off of you. Yes. Come on, man. Come on. Heart attacks yes. going to go down. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They're going to go down. But long as you start, as long as you wrestling against flesh and blood, uh -huh. huh? Yes. In other words, you think you wrestling against flesh and blood, but you actually wrestling against spiritual wickedness in yes. high places yes. that you can't handle. Yes. 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 When you wrestling yes. with that stuff yes. and thinking you're going you to bring it, to go down, uh -huh. and it started pushing you off the edge. Because uh -huh. uh -huh. you keep rattling, you're going to start telling them just what they need to hear. Uh -huh. Huh? Yeah. Something wrong. Just, 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 yeah. just let it go. Yeah. God got that. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. But, but I said that the lady came to church three or four Sundays in a row, and she was dynamic. Yes. She was diligent in what she wanted to know. Hey, Minister Capers, how you doing today? How's your wife? Yeah. I say, ma'am, I don't have a wife. She looked at me real funny. Mm -hmm. Went on my way. Next Sunday she come back. Hey, Minister Capers, how you doing? How's your wife? <laughs> I say, ma'am, you know, the tell go up a little bit here. Uh -huh. I don't have a wife. Yeah. The third time she came back, I was walking into the pastor's office just past the secretary, and she was standing off to the side. She said, I got this Negro where I want him at now. Uh, I'm over here with all these folks at the guy. The man ain't nothing but a man to me. Huh? Me, we both gonna eat some bread. Me and Pastor Boy like chicken, steak, and pork chop. And pork chop. Huh? Hey, Mr. Capers, how you doing? Secretary sitting like right they all garnished up, you know. Hi, Joe Wine. Then Mr. Cable come out. Uh oh. Uh oh. One! How many times I got to tell you that I don't have no wife? She dropped her head, and the fourth time she come back and she explained the whole ordeal. I walked into the sanctuary and, hey, Minister Cables, give me a hug. Okay, I'm just so sorry that I kept asking you about your wife. She said, but you hadn't changed a bit. Oh, nah. I lost the love of my life. So when I get up to the altar, and falling all out. Yeah. My wife was on a pedestal because I put her up there. Oh. Oh. When she got down off it, oh Lord, oh Lord, she down off it. 
She don't have to answer to me no more. She offered the pedestal. And any man that don't, a man that, 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 that loves his wife, love who? God. God. Come on, good. That's what the scripture say. A man that love his wife, love himself. Huh? Amen. He love himself. Yes, the God in his man. It, it got to be, if it's going to be pure. The boys at work say, say, come here, come here, come here, Joe, come here, don't do that, Joe. Joe going to the house, but the poor folk that had to roll the papers on, kicking those in, boom. Yeah. Don't go back over there no more. We signed a warrant. Don't go back over there. He locked up in jail, and the boys at work trying to coach him. Don't go back, Joe. Don't do that, Joe. And then they, they look, say, uh, 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 Caleb got the boys. He ain't doing all that. And he called him one of them long lies. Mm. One of them long lies. Because mm. I've been loud mouth all my day. Always keep it up and going and going and going like the other child's a bunny rabbit. He told him, say, y'all lying. Ain't no way. That man ain't never broke his vocals now and then he come in him. And he come and he asked me. I said, oh, that happened to me, bro. I, I never thought it would happen. I never thought it would be that way, but yeah, that's how it went down like that. But my faith and my hope is in God. Yes, right. Amen. To Christ Jesus, my Lord. That's what keeps me. I don't care if my wife mad at me. I'm going to hug her at night. If she happy with me, I'm going to hug her at night. Come on. Because it ain't about me. Y'all yeah, know something. They get up, folks. I hear some folks got other room they sleep in. Don't let nothing make you so mad till you take a knife to yourself. Yes. When you start separating yourself from your wife or your husband, you separate yourself. God has made you one flesh. One. One. Treat it that way. Just like you one with the Lord, be one in your church, one in your house, one everywhere you go. Love people for who they are. If you can't change them, the Bible, what is it? The world come up with this. I ain't never read it in the Bible. What does serenity prayer say? Lord, help me change the thing that I can change. Huh? Except the thing I cannot change. And the wisdom enough to know the difference between the two. Because God didn't intend for everybody to flip over like a cheese on it for you. You don't believe me? Ask David. David wanted to build a temple, didn't he? Yes. No. Your son going to do that. Go somewhere and sit down. So many words. But you know what you do? And Paul said it like this. Paul planted. Paul was born. God don't give you any creatures. If you want somebody to love you, want them to love you like God loves you. Amen. Don't want them to love you because you got some kind of hold over them. But want them to love you the way God loves you. God loved you so much when you were his enemy. He gave his son for you and I. That's the kind of love you want somebody to love you with. Preach. 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 God's been there all the time. God bless you and God keep you. Amen. Amen.